Hello, I'm Jovan Johnson. Opposition spokesperson on health Dr. Murray Sky is calling for Minister of Health and Wellness Dr. Christopher Tufton to address allegations implicating him and a public relations company. Dr. Guy says if there's any truth to the allegations about multiple contracts between the company and Tufton's ministry, then there should be an investigation. The government entity that manages the country's sugar lands said it did not know that the son of de facto agriculture minister J.C. Hutchinson was operating a business at Holland Estate in St. Elizabeth. Mr. Hutchinson is embroiled in a scandal over how a company in which his partner was a director and shareholder was selected to manage the former sugar lands. And communities dependent on the Appleton Estate sugar factory in St. Elizabeth are facing an uncertain future following news that the Jerry and Nephew Limited owned facility will end production of the sweetener because of heavy losses during the 2019 2020 crop year. A parliamentary committee has heard conflicting accounts that Prime Minister Andrew Holness offered no objection to the controversial sale of a beachfront property in Ocherius, St. Anne, for 200,000 US dollars when the real estate was valued at 3.5 million US dollars. Permanent Secretary in the Ministry of Economic Growth and Job Creation, Audrey Sewell, said there was some administrative mix-up at the ministry and wholeness should not be blamed. In sports, Dom Sibley and Ben Stokes batted England into a strong position on the first day of the second test against the Windies. The English closed the day on 207 for three with a Sibley who was dropped by the Windies captain, not out on 86. In your currency trading today, one US dollar was being sold for $146.12. The British pound sterling for $183.33 and the Canadian dollar for $109.68. In your weather forecast, Friday morning will be mainly sunny. In the afternoon, expect scattered showers and thunderstorms across sections of most parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Jovan Johnson.